Wrestler mood for you. Randy the Ram was a big wrestler in the 80s, complete with his signature move, the Ram Jam, which I think is what comes out if you stick a goat into a blender. However, it's no longer the 80s. His glory days are over, but he still enjoys the fame and the recognition in a significantly lesser scope. And then he has a heart attack. The doctors say he won't survive if he keeps wrestling, so he has to try to make a regular life work. And he has a lot of problems with this. The major theme here is Aronofsky's old favorite of imagination versus reality. One example is, of course, is wrestling real? You know, you hear all this stuff about it's just acting, but then again, sometimes they do seem to get hurt. That is one example. Another is Randy's life in the ring versus his life in the real world. There are other examples that I won't give away here. The film does start out a little slow, but my fellow non-fans of wrestling, I urge you to keep watching if you are at all interested in the conflict, because it does pay off. Aronofsky does not let us down at all. The acting is really good. This was a pretty perfect role for Rourke, and he shines like the sun is right now. The, the dialogue is quite good. The film does a very good job of establishing Randy's life within a pretty short amount of time and really, in general, another of Aronofsky's strengths. Just, it builds atmosphere pretty quickly and moves on to another situation so that it doesn't feel like it's ever really meandering. And at the same time, you do feel the boredom and pain of these situations. I would definitely recommend this to any fan of Aronofsky and in general any fan of dramas. It is a very touching story and as much as pretty few of us can relate to the exact situation, it's still... anyone can relate to a loss of identity and suddenly having to go back to a kind of life that you had abandoned long ago.